Okay, we're just going to do the second example, and it's a, a very simple example, but I want to point out a couple problems, or not problems, features of the nodal analysis. So again, in this question, we want to find the two voltages that I'm going to... This is 2 milliamps, this is 2 kilo ohms, this is 15 kilo ohms and 10 kilo ohms. And now there's a 5 volt voltage source on the left. So I'm going to again put my reference node here. And mind you, I am going to write V1 and V2, but I have for free that V1 is 5 volts. Because these two elements are in parallel. So we know that the voltage on the 15 kilo ohm resistor is 5 volts. Furthermore, I know this current here, the I on the 15. I'm going to now mark these other currents. And here, I'm not even sure where to, but I'm going to put, I'm going to mark it like that. And uh, therefore, I only have one equation for KCL on node V2 is going to be the current on the 2K plus 2 milliamps. This current is going into this node equals the current on the 10K. And now I'm just going to write the current on the 2K is V1 minus V2 divided by 2K plus 2 milliamps equals V2 divided by 10K. Now I know V1, which is 5 volts, so it's 5. Actually, I'm going to multiply all this by 10K. This whole equation here by 10K to make my life easier. This is 5V1 minus 5V2 plus 20 equals V2. Uh, 5U1 equals 25. Minus 5V2, I'll put on the other side. It's going to be 6V2. So 6V2 equals 45. V2 equals 45 divided by 6, which I don't know how much it is. So I'm going to cheat here. 45 divided by 6 equals 7.5 volts. So basically, very easily, I found these two main node voltages. And obviously, if I wanted the current instead, I would have very easily found the current on the 15K, which is one-third of an amp, milliamps, 333 milliamps. The uh, voltage on the 10K is 7.5, so the current there is 7.5 divided by 10k, which is 0 0.75 milliamps. Is this right even? This is 0.33. Zero point. Are you not checking, Teresa? You checking? And I, on the 2k, equals this voltage minus this voltage, so 5 minus 7.5 volts divided by 2k, which is minus 2.5 volts divided by 2, which is minus 1.25 milliamps. Now, this was not asked, but I'm hoping this is clear to you guys how to, how to find voltages and currents. And this was somewhat simpler circuit than the first example. It was just really this note that we had to put the KCL on. Now we'll do another example. 